Ad optimization is, I think, part strategy and part technical. But when your ads are optimized, they become certainly targeted, more engaging, effective, and most importantly, they deliver the desired outcome. One of the platforms we use to help manage digital media investment allows us to prioritize optimizations based on desired outcomes. Hello, and welcome to Media in the Moment. I'm Chuck Federley, and it's time for a quick Q&A Tuesday. Today's question, what can I expect from ad optimization? Well, optimizing your ads simply means improving ad or campaign performance. Ad optimization is something you do after the campaign has started, although some could argue it should be done before the campaign starts. I would simply call that good media planning. Well, optimizing ads and campaigns has been around a long time. And, you know, early on in my career, when I was planning and buying a lot of TV and radio, uh, we did a lot of DR TV or DR radio, direct response ads. And we would place our ads in programming or at a rate we thought was appropriate. We would monitor our buys. We would match up responses and determine if the investment was what we called paying out or producing enough ROAS in today's terms, return on ad spend. And if it wasn't, we could reallocate media outlets. We could change day parts or programs. We'd certainly lower the rate or attempt to renegotiate that rate. We could revise the creative, um, all to help improve campaign performance. And this was and is optimization. Well, theoretically, it's no different in today's digital media environment. The difference is digital media offers an incredible amount of opportunity when it comes to ad optimization. So, for example, one of the platforms we use to help manage digital media investment allows us to prioritize optimizations based on desired outcomes like reach and frequency, uh, clicks, viewability, or, of course, conversions. Um, the last time I checked, this platform has over eight different ways to optimize for conversions, for example. So what are some of the other benefits of ad optimization? Well, these extend beyond just boosting click-through or conversion rates. I think optimizing your ads includes making sure your ads are seen by a broader segment of your target audience to significantly increase your brand's visibility. And this might also improve media efficiency at the same time. Um, another optimization might use some data-driven insights to refine the targeting criteria or the media allocation. Now, this approach focuses impression weight, so your ads are being shown to individuals who may be more in market or most likely to be interested in your products or services. Ad optimization is, I think, part strategy and part technical. But when your ads are optimized, they become certainly targeted, more engaging, effective, and most importantly, they deliver the desired outcome. So make sure your media team is providing you good ad optimization. I'm Chuck Federley, and you've been listening to Media in the Moment.